Welcome to Thermco Products YouTube channel. This instructional video is for the configuration of the LogTag Vaccine Temperature Data Logger model TRED30-16R. This is a brief guide in acquiring the LogTag software, installation of the software, and configuring the LogTag for temperature monitoring. Please note that a LogTag USB dock is required. To get started, you will need to download the current version of software from LogTag's website, Google LogTagRecorders.com. Select the result that matches LogTagRecorders.com. And on the home page, click the download software icon that is located on the left center of the web page. Next, click the button View Log Tag Analyzer 3. Now, fill out the form fields with your name, email address, and if you want, fill the company and position fields. Then tick I have read and agreed to the terms and conditions box and click the button Go to Downloads page. On the download page, you also have available the user guide, release notes, and software validation certificate if required. Click now for software download. Click run at the bottom of the screen to start the installation. Click yes to the pop-up. Do you want to allow this app to make changes to your device? Click next. Click next. Click I accept the terms in the license agreement. Click next. Click next. Click next again. And now click the install button. The software installation is now complete. Click the finish button and close the install window. A shortcut icon will now be on your desktop for the Analyzer 3 software. Okay, now we're ready to uh, connect the uh, cradle to the USB port of your PC. So make sure you don't have a log tag in. Take your USB and connect it to your PC. Now we can start Analyzer 3. Okay, now put the log tag in the cradle. And we can click OK or just wait for it and it disappears. And then we click on Wizard. Wait for it to verify. Go down, click Configure. In the first field, you can give the unit a description we've already named it lab you have the choice of uh, giving passwords to both the configuration and the download but if the passwords are ever lost the unit would have to be sent back to factory to uh, be unlocked your choice um, we recommend push button start do not tick enable pre-start logging we also recommend the choice record uh, settings so that the readings are 31 days, number of readings to record 2977, 15 minutes, and no delay. These are all the default settings. Recommend just leave them the way they are. In the lower section, you have audible alarm if available. We recommend ticking that. Trigger alarm when reading 
is above or equal to. In this case, we have it set to 8 degrees. That's the default for uh, refrigerated vaccines. You can uh, change the values by just ticking up, ticking down to whatever values you want. And the same for the lower. We'd also recommend having trigger alarm when readings are below or equal to. In this case, for vaccines, it's 2 degrees for most states. And that's your alarm triggering set points. Now, on the advanced tag, we recommend just leaving everything as they are in their default. And at this point now, you click configure, wait for the tone, and then you'll see on the screen it says ready and the time. All you got to do now is close this and you're all set to go. Okay, now we've completed configuring the log tag logger. Let's close the application. At this point, it should be noted that the sensor buffer bottle should be placed in the storage unit that is going to be monitored for approximately 30 minutes to an hour prior to logging data. To start logging, press and hold the start clear stop button. On the screen, the word starting will be flashing. Continue holding until the flashing stops then release the button. You are now logging data. We are in an excursion due to the fact that we're monitoring uh, ambient room temperature, which is not within the range of 2 to 8 degrees C. But in your case, if the buffer bottle was to um, equilibrium in the storage unit, then you would not have an excursion. That concludes our instructional video for the log tag data logger.